All right, hey guys, this is Michael Huber, and I thought I'd show a little tutorial about how I put time lapse uh, photos together, or photos together to create a time lapse uh, using Lightroom. Um, you can use Windows Media Player, uh, Premiere Pro, After Effects, a variety of different tools, but um, this one I found to be pretty easy and uh, does a pretty good job, especially since I already use Lightroom. Um, so basically, you can see here I've got a bunch of pictures and I, I took these with uh, my GoPro camera actually sitting on an egg timer on the dock um, capturing the sunset and uh, I'm not sure how many photos there are a couple hundred or so I took one shot every half second so first thing you do is obviously bring them into uh, Lightroom and I'm just in the library module here then I select all of the photos that I want for the time lapse and I go into slideshow and within the slideshow there's a bunch of different templates that Lightroom comes with um, caption rating, crop to fill, um, etc. but for this you need to actually import um, a, a different template so the best one that I found is from LRB plugins and these are time lapse time lapse presets and you just scroll down to the bottom download presets and then just follow the instructions on loading it into Lightroom believe me it's really easy uh, so anyway you've got uh, your pictures selected uh, that uh, we highlighted earlier brought them into slideshow now we have the templates here of different frame rates and in America uh, we use 24 or actually 23.97 uh, frames per second in the rest of the world um, it's about 30 frames a second or 29.97 frames a second I don't don't really remember why that is but you'll notice that on your cell phones and and things like that any other kind of video cameras that are mainly made from overseas the typical frame rate is set at that 30 frames a second um, but for here I'm going to use the 23.97 frames per second so I just click on that and then all you need to do is go down to export video all right so let's just throw that on the desktop for a second uh, call it Sun oops sunset time lapse and in the video presets you can change that to 480 640 1080p 720p is fine um, for the resolution of computer monitors and frankly most large screen TVs uh, so I'll just put it at 720p hit save and then uh, it is making that you look up here it's exporting the slideshow as a video uh, so it's that simple and uh, once this is done I'll include it uh, right now so thanks for watching mm -hmm.